Hi guys, it's me, Debbie Bubbles. Welcome back to my channel and into the walls of my home. <laughs> guys, it's the weekend! Or it was when I filmed this anyway. <laughs> so, I don't know what day you're going to see it. But, you know, I was fishing around for some content. So, I decided I'd kick something up again. <laughs> I have bad jokes and puns here. But anyway, y'all. So, we're going to work with some yellowtail fish. And so I have two yellowtail fish fillets there. And over here to the side, I'm showing you some of the spices and the ingredients that are gonna go into this meal. And let me tell you off right off, it's gonna change midway because I um, I had a kitchen blunder and so I had to um, <laughs> I had to come up with something different. Not the main dish, the the, the yellowtail fish it, it, it's here it's wonderful but my side dish i had to change it up midways so anyway y'all we're gonna start off here with my blend jet and some almonds i have slivered almonds that i'm going to chop into kind of a, a pretty fun um grind there and after they have ground down to the texture i need them i'm going to add them into a plate of panko bread crumbs because this is going to coat our fish here in a little bit so i don't know if you have a blend jet or not this is my first time using mine i bought it probably four or five years ago <laughs> but i've never used it i just actually took it out of the box today washed it up and we're using it so anyway over on the stove top is the blender i started water boiling or i started water to boil some brown rice but um we're not going to end up with brown rice because yeah anyway so back over here to the panko bread crumbs and the chopped almonds we blended those together and we're going to set those aside i quartered mushrooms and chopped the stems now i'm going to season the yellowtail fish Now that we have the fish fillet seasoned up, we're going to set those aside over there next to the panko breadcrumbs and the almond mixture that we have going because we're going to do something with that here in a little bit. We're going to actually create a little bit of a assembly line. But first, let me go ahead and line my baking sheet with some foil. And next, we're going to slather on some mayo on top of the fish fillets. And here is where things went bad. So, I got a text, then I took a phone call, and I sat down for a minute, was watching a little something on the TV, while my rice was boiling, right? Well, <laughs> all of a sudden, there's like flames in the kitchen, and so, boy, they, what are we going to do? Our side dish is no more. Okay, so maybe I over-exaggerated. All the water boiled off of the rice. It did not burn. There was no fire, but I just decided, hey, we should go with something else. So anyway, we're going to dive back into the fish dish. <laughs> so I told you, I have my assembly line going here. I've mixed the panko breadcrumbs with those almonds that I chopped. And now I have coated the fish fillets with the mayonnaise. We're going to go ahead Top, sit them on top of the panko almond mixture get it nice and coated and there's one filet we're gonna go back repeat the same process with a second filet and each of them we're gonna lay neatly on our baking sheet so that we can put this in the oven and bake it off with our fish being filleted already and it's not very thick and cut where it's not gonna take very long to bake so we're gonna put that in the oven for about 15 minutes, 12 to 15 minutes, just until it reaches a nice, beautiful golden brown and our meat is nice and tender and white so that we know that it is ready to go. And while this was baking, I decided that, hey, you know what? We'll do a side dish of broccoli, yellow potatoes, cheese, and mushrooms. So that is what you're seeing over to the side. Some Yukon gold potatoes with broccoli, mushrooms, and cheddar cheese. And there is that beautiful, beautiful filet of yellowtail fish. What do you think? 
So we're going to amp this up just a little bit more. And on top of that yellowtail, we're going to drizzle it with a thick and sweet soy sauce just to give it a little extra edge. Mwah. And we're calling this dinner done. So let's sit down and let's enjoy this meal together. Pull up a chair. I'll pour you a glass of wine and we will enjoy dining together. All right, guys, somebody please mwah, kiss the chef. But <laughs> until next time, until next video, until I decide to get in the kitchen and film again, y'all enjoy your evening. God bless you. Be safe. And mwah, I love you. And we'll see you soon. Bye-bye for now.